morning YouTube. Today I'm going to a meeting in Ghent, a very important meeting, and I will tell you more about it later. I type in the address in Ghent. Okay, we are driving to Ghent and in Ghent there is a two-day meeting, European community meeting, organized by Belgium, because Belgium is president of the European Union um, this time. <coughs> and the meeting, in, the meeting is about automated and connected drive. Okay, let's talk about automatic driving, autonomous vehicles. Why is it so important? Let's listen to a fragment of Kathy Wood on CNBC News in the United States. She is explaining why it's so important. Two thirds of the valuation. Do you feel like that there's risk even around the bear case at all with the two thirds? Actually, the risks are going down because regulators are very data driven. And what regulators have been experiencing, especially in the transportation sector, is that the number of auto deaths in the United States have gone up, has gone up during the past five to ten years from 30,000 to 45,000 after decades of falling thanks to auto safety measures. So the National Highway and Transportation Safety Board and other transportation authorities want to turn that trend back down. Why has it happened? A lot of it is because of texting and therefore a disproportionate number of young people are dying in auto, auto uh, accidents. So the data supports what Tesla is doing. 80 to 90% of all accidents on the roads are caused by human error. If you take the human being out of the equation uh, and, um, and use AI to get people from point A to point B as safely as quickly as possible, um, I think the, the, the authorities, the regulators, are going to be persuaded by the data. In fact, they already have been in terms of the fatalities in, uh, in Tesla's cars. They examine them, they say, not Tesla's fault for the most part. And oh, by the way, uh, people driving in Tesla cars are 40% plus safer uh, with autopilot and FSD than mm -hmm. in other cars. Yes, maybe you're not interested in all this talk about Tesla's stock. But the most important message is the importance of full self-drive for safety in cars and how this will influence our future. Now, as I explained to you earlier, there was a meeting in Ghent this week, which is all about this subject, putting it back on the political agenda in Europe.
This two-day event took place in Ghent in a very nice area, the Beiloko site. Uh, this, this is where a part of the Ghent University is located, but also a cultural center, music center here. This used to be an abbey, a hospital in the Middle Ages. It has a very nice conference hall, different conference halls in the church. This is a view in the war room where the meetings are prepared. And this is one of the organizers. And I will organize an interview with him uh, talking about what happened and what is going to happen in Europe. Overall, it was a very lively and interesting event with displays, demonstrations, remote controlled cars, self driving cars. BMW and Volkswagen were represented. And believe it or not, Tesla participated. At the end, the official documents were signed by officials from Europe, Belgium, Flanders and many other countries. And a lot of commitments were made. We will talk more about that in the next edition to be continued.